Welcome back to the kitchen table. Bit of a serious one today on the kitchen table then. Uh, on Halloween, which was yesterday, the 31st of October, uh, in a very rare and unusual step, both DJI, the FAA and the CAA uh, released a safety notice uh, which involves DJI equipment. So uh, I'll read it word for word from the CAA, as I'm based in the UK, uh, but it's the same message for everyone. The safety notice supersedes a previous notice. Now, originally, a DJI battery uh, was causing some problems. This affected the Matrice range, the Matrice 200 range, uh, which includes the 200, 210, and 210 RTK platforms. However, there is an additional battery added to this. Uh, so both the TB50 and the TB55s, uh, which is all of the Matrice 200 series, and also the Inspire 2. Now, this obviously is the serious one. Uh, there's an awful lot of Inspire 2 users out there. A small number of incidents have recently been reported where the aircraft has suffered a complete loss of power during the flight. Despite indications there was sufficient battery time still remaining. In each case, this resulted in the aircraft falling directly to the ground due to the immediate loss of lift with the remote pilot unable to control its subsequent flight path. The small unmanned aircraft was damaged upon impact, but the CAA has not received any reports of injuries to people or other property. This basically means that there is a problem with the TB50 and the TB55 batteries. As I say, quite a global response to this uh, with both DJI and the FAA and the CAA releasing safety notices about this. It basically, it grounds everything, with the exception to police, who I understand in the UK still have uh, availability to use them, but with increased safety notices. Uh, the safety notice is to highlight the requirement of the SUA operator and or remote pilot to be reasonably satisfied that the flight can safely be made um, restrict overflight of persons at any height and to temporarily limit the scope of any operation authorised issued to operators with affected SUAs. So effectively it does ground Matrice 200s and Inspire 2s. Now this is the advice from the CAA in the UK. Um, it would be advisable for everybody to take note of this that uses those batteries. So the batteries uh, which I'll show on screen now are the TB50 and the TB55. If you have problems with them, get back to DJI. They are fully aware of the problem and are going to what they have said is release a firmware update uh, to hopefully solve the problem. But if you are flying a Matrice 200 or an Inspire 2, please don't ground it. Luckily in the UK, the weather is appalling, so chances are you wouldn't be flying anyway. Uh, but ground it, wait till there's more safety notices released both from DJI and the CAA and the FAA. And so that is today's rather serious back on the kitchen table uh, message. So please, the batteries, TB50, TB55s, if you're flying those, do not fly. It's as simple as that. There's a problem with incorrect voltage being displayed and uh, they have aircraft falling out of the air. So just beware of that then. Uh, we will have more news about drones on the kitchen table very soon. But right now, thanks for watching and be safe out there.